All right, what's up, Locker Nuts? We're back in this unit, and uh, Noah's with me. What's so, up, guys? Say hello, Noah. You guys might remember him from a flea market video a few months ago. Here I right? am. Yep. And look so at this, guys. Right Funko Pops. <laughs> and, uh, wow. Power Girl, Super Girl. This is stuff that looks so much like what we found in that other locker, and I keep tripping out thinking I got the same guy. And this one right here, this is a metal. Yeah, this is a metal one. We found one in the box, and we found one or two loose in the other locker. I swear this is the same same guy. Same guy. I bought two lockers from different facilities, different yeah, times of the year. Cool. That is cool. And um, Some of them are empty. Some are empty. I probably had them in the other locker. <laughs> the loose ones? Yeah. Oh, I had this. I had that. I oh, had yeah. that. This has got to be the same guy. It's 45 bucks. I already sold it, but so might as well dump it. But I had this exact figurine right here. That's nuts. There's this this super girl. This those is it. The boxes to the. We found a loose one of those too, and I found one in the box. This is insane. This is the second time that I've bought the same it's owner's the unit this year. Wow. Guardians of the Galaxy. Hmm. Collect right. Collectors. I'll get a bin to put all these in. So we can keep it. Another empty one. That's too bad. Oh, those are good. Disney. Aladdin. Power Black Rangers. Ranger. Yeah, this is cool. This is uh, stuff we're definitely going to sell in our whatnot auction. It's fun. And back here, you see, we got the. Uh, we, 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 we can see the back wall. That's. That's something new. I was really hoping to find a big stack of comic books in the back. I, I haven't found that yet. That is what we found in the other unit. His other one in the very back corner is a bunch of comic books. But still could be hiding back there. Just the chances are going down and down and down. Mr. Potato Head is Thor. Oh, that's funny. We found a Mr. Potato Head kiss earlier. We've got um, all this for the flea market here. Sorting some stuff here. It looks kind of crazy. Uh, a little bit more flea market, a little bit more stuff to bring home here. This uh, trailer right here, we filled it up just a little while ago and Noah took it to the dump. How much was it? 188 bucks? Oh man, it's, yeah, that was 188 it's, bucks. It's a ripoff. Robbery. Robbery. And then I've got my Honda and I filled it with electronics and metal earlier and took it to recycle for free. But we got to figure out how to get rid of all these tires. And uh, wow, look at this, guys. This is, reminds me of the other unit so much because it's it's craziness. Everything is just slammed in here, jammed in here. You pull one thing out, and you already had junk lanch, right? What is it? A junk lanch. Oh yeah. Earlier, you <laughs> pull one thing out, and everything else falls on him. That's a funny thing. <laughs> I learned that from American Pickers. Yeah, that's uh. Look at the, look at this. How it's rigged up here. It's dangerous. There's a whole trunk right there, though. Um, we had another like foot locker type trunk, like college dorm room type locker uh, trunk, and it was there was nothing. Oh, there's cameras in it, old cameras, which is also something we found in the other unit was collections of old cameras. There's some action figures here, Rick and Morty stuff. Uh, I mean, there's there's some potential. It's actually looking a little better the deeper we get, but so far, I'm pulling out like miscellaneous little toys, loose toys. And, uh, this kind of stuff right here. I've been pulling this out and just putting it in bins. A, a little bit of electronics, a, 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 quite a bit of clothes, decent clothes, like some vintage clothes, um, but not huge, huge money. Like I told Jan, I'm, I'm not really seeing too many things that come out here that are worth more than five bucks per piece. The Funkos are a little better, but the clothes, the vintage clothes, maybe we'll get 10 bucks each on them at the market. But um, the most of the items are very small, but accumulating, <laughs> it's a dollar here, two dollars here, it adds up, but $188 for one dump load. Yeah, that's right. We've got a second dump load to go, and yeah, that's, yeah. Well, anyways, that's our update. We'll turn the camera back on if we find more good stuff. Hopefully we do. Peace. All right, guys, Noah's making a trip right now to the recycle before they close. Uh, making good progress here. We're down to the back, and it's looking better back here, which I commented before. We're seeing action figures and toys in there. This appears to be all closed right here, but the sides are looking good up there. Has some potential, this truck. All right, what's up, guys? We are back. Back, and wow, did look, Noah and I make some progress here. Check this out. We are pretty much to the back, back side of this unit and um it's looking a little better too back here uh we've seen some old stuff like this radio and toys good good amount of toys and stuff look at and there i see some hot wheels and uh rick and morty stuff it's looking kind of interesting seems the further we get back and look at that, that's a tub full of toys right there uh I know there's still some junk in there. This is mostly, I think, all clothes. So far, these garbage bags have had clothes, but they're decent clothes. There's some bins here that we pulled out that looked interesting. I gotta go through uh, closer, slower, 
on camera. This is all stuff to go to Stockton. This is all stuff we sorted out that's good, better, you know? Funko Pops, there's some Lego. Look at this, a lot of toys, a lot of really cool toys too. You know, bobblehead Wolverine right there. This metal Iron Man. It's a pretty cool glass piece right here. If I remember in the other unit, it looks like what's left of a Goodwill sticker on there. In the other unit, he had some glassware, which was kind of surprising, and it was actually decent stuff. I found some dude wipes. You never know when you might need that. Found some baseball cards. And I think this one I still got to go through. It looks kind of junky. Down here is some good stuff I put aside. Over here are all the Funkos that me and Noah found. Some albums in there. And uh, this is all good stuff. Look at this. Well, yeah, there's brand new. Bart Simpson rude socks right there. There's some Transformers. Old Viewmaster. Oh, Mickey Mouse Viewmaster. Uh, so this Futurama DVDs, that's okay. Um, look at this right here. A Remington small arms ammunition shotgun shells. It's a little ammo box. I don't know if that's decorative or, or for real, but this box I think I gotta go through. There's an empty Pokemon. There's a Wonder Woman book. Mustang. I think this is a little better stuff in here. Oh, uh, man. Uh, but this is, Stockton stuff is not bad. I mean, look, there's an old lunch pail right there. Chicago Bears plushie. It looks pretty dirty, though. A lot of single shoes. There's Air Jordans right there, but it's just one shoe. Seems to be an ongoing problem with this guy's lockers. Oh, man. Bowls 23. There's Michael Jordan's jersey, but it's really thrashed. And look at the sleeves almost completely torn off. But maybe someone will do something with that. I don't know. Noah and I made a ton of progress, guys. And I'm sorry, I did not film hardly anything here. I decided that this locker is taking me too much time. And filming really slows us down. And I need to get done with this thing. The time is the real cost. Well, it's not the only cost. So if you remember, we had like two huge shelves here, big old shelves here, and just heaps of stuff. Well, working with Noah is much much faster for me um usually i'm working by myself but with noah he rented a trailer so we loaded a u-haul trailer and my truck at the same time my truck got metal and electronics and his trailer got stuff to go to the dump which he did he ran to the dump while i was processing the other day and uh actually it's been a while we got a lot done two trips to the dump and two trips to the recycle center eight hundred dollars in expenses between rental on the trailer dump fees and paying noah to help 800 bucks guys most of that was dump fees because of those tires we had stacks of tires and rims and they cost $17 per piece to dump it's insanely expensive to dump right now so um anyways uh but we you know the last time I went to the market we barely made any money with this locker surprisingly it was really really tough so I didn't want to take too big of a load out there so really the stuff that I put aside here is kind of decent stuff and then of course we got the better stuff going to our live auctions all right well right now let me get to uh some unboxing because I think we I've identified a few boxes that look pretty good all right, first though, let's get more stuff on the trailer. Got a lot of room here. I already started a little bit, and then we have leftovers from the last time, but uh, got, got a lot more room, and I think we're gonna fill it up today. All right, guys, made some progress, and yeah, everything left here, I think, is either good stuff or stuff to go through. So, oh, these ones. <laughs> You guys hear me groaning and stuff. Unfortunately, I pulled my back a couple days ago, so took it easy yesterday, but today, back to work. Uh, these right here are some gift cards. I seriously doubt there's anything on this, but there's always a chance. It's a chance. What's in here? Oh, that's right. Noah found this. Very fancy wine opener. Vintage corkscrew collection from True. I don't know. That's kind of a neat piece. I'll put that aside. Be kind of fun for our live auctions, you know? Check this out, Loot Crate, LC, Westworld. Huh, they look very sad. I've never seen uh, Westworld, this, the, new, the new one. Saw the old one with the old Brenner, that was pretty dope, if I remember correctly. Prop knife for Halloween, good timing. Hmm, seems like a... Hmm, okay. There's definitely been a little bit better toys in here. You know, the further we go back, the toys get a little better. Oh, there's Adventure Time. The Nice King and Gunther. Put that aside. Some more wrestling guys, it looks like. Yeah, it looks like a pretty fancy heart, or blood pressure monitor here. Hmm. Might put that aside. Just to look at later. Huh, that's neat. Oh, turtles, nice. Yeah, man, there's a lot of this stuff, guys. Oh, that one's gross. <laughs> Let's 
this neat old metal can right there. I think that'll sell. Lego Star Wars? Hmm. Huh. Okay. Now these each have little figurines in them. Oh, these little rubber guys. That's kind of neat. That guy looks kind of cool. I've not seen him before. Got some bigger figures in here too, like the Spider Man. Neat. Aquaman. And I think that's a Monster High doll right there. And uh, we've definitely been getting requests for Monster High toys. Of course, it'd be better if it was brand new in the box, but whatever. Huh. This is a brand new one here. Headliners, hockey, Ninja Turtles again. Oh, okay, check this out, guys. I spotted this the other day and I put it aside because I wanted to take a few minutes on it. This is really cool. It's like a real hat, whatever you call that. Is that a safari hat? I'm not sure, but it, it is definitely neat. I've never seen one like this. It's uh, very high quality. Okay, here we got some nice plush here, but I don't, looks like it's all tie. Oh, maybe I did already go through this one. Can't remember. There's a nice little Pez, little Pepsi thing. I'll let that go. Little Pez. All right, got some more plush here. These are not, well, it looks like some are Beanie Babies, but some are some other type of tie. All right, this one I think we did actually go through already. Pull some nicer stuff out. All right, a little teacup. Limoges. Oh, dang. Okay, that's a Limoges right there. Okay, so we'll be putting that aside. That's why, that's why we pulled it out. We, had a, we worked here a long time that day. Oh, and this is neat. I'm not exactly sure what it is. Two bucks. I kind of see a face there, but I'll put that aside. This little pin right here, six dollars. And then these things, see, so see right here, it's got a Disney sticker on it with the barcode. Oh yeah, neat. 50th happiest homecoming on earth. I don't know if there's gonna be any value on these, but definitely it warrants putting them aside. Bring them home, take a closer look, look them up. What's this? Oh, this is, a, I think, a tattoo. Ancient Marks. It's like a tattoo book, a coffee table book. Hmm. <clears throat> That's what it is. Pretty neat. Here's the next box. I think I went through some of this that night. We were trying to go as fast as we could. We are running out of time. And some of the stuff like this, I'm like, ah, that's potentially worth a little money. Light bulbs. But I couldn't see that well in the dark. So I said, let me put this aside to make sure I don't toss anything that's worth keeping. Galaxy Quest emblem patch. That's neat. d -backs. A little wallet. That's another transformer. So just some little plastic coins. Coasters. Somebody's missing their head right here. Okay, got a couple of bins here. Same type of thing. Oh, Transformers. See a little Transformer icon on that? That's good. I mean, they're not high-end ones. They're a lighter plastic. Some Lego. Yeah, a little bit of change. 13 cents. <laughs> There's more Transformers. Cool. More plush right here, and that's Winnie the Pooh. Look at this guy, 1977. That's a little bit older. 1973 on this, Dakin. It's really dirty though. Hmm. Still, it is old plush, old plush. Ah, oh, look at this guy. He does something. This, that mouth moves. Batteries are dead. Kind of interested about that. Oh, he's missing a foot. Bummer. Okay, it's another old book. It's in Spanish. We'll bring it to the market. They'll know what to do. A little Batgirl plush. Oh, this Astro Boy. Um, Noah had seen this and put it aside. Oh, cool. Right, isn't that Astro Boy? But it's all in Japanese or something. That is neat. Okay, we'll put that aside. Wonder Woman alarm clock. It's a little scratched up though. It's a bank too. Wait, is that what it is? Maybe not. Ah. Pretty corroded inside. Could that have value? I don't think so. Hmm. I'll put it aside, but I think it's gonna go right back to the flea market. Now there's another one of those old banks right here. Huh? And I think it's probably a reproduction. The other ones we found were probably reproductions. Looks like you put the penny right here or whatever. The coin. Huh. <laughs> I don't know, that's pretty neat. What's this? Live to ride, born to live. 7i. Hmm. It's for something. Lighter, maybe? 
That's neat. Look at that. A little tiny vase. It's nice. No Mickey. Oh, there's the Joker right here. Pretty dirty. Hot Wheels. Oh, there's a nice piece of glass right there. Look at this. New to Jarvie. Oh, it's signed too. Wow. Not chipped. Amazingly not chipped. Wow. Made in Finland, it says. Oh my goodness. This is just like the other one. You guys, I, I mean, let me just trip out once again about how crazy the story is here that we have bought the same locker twice, right? I mean, it's, it's just insanely coincidental. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Explain to me again why I need a man. So I will sift out all these little toys and stuff, anything that's sellable, and we'll make big lots out of that, sell it in bulk. Uh, those are little candles. Okay, I thought they were something nicer. Yeah, so I'll go through this. I'll pull all the good stuff out, guys, and uh, I'll let you know if I find anything amazing. All right, just a, a few cool things. There's Andre the Giant, another wrestling figurine. Uh, there's the Transformers right here, brand new. Grimlock, mint limited edition, it says. And a little Power Ranger guy. Nice. <laughs> all right, next bin says Fragile. And I don't think that is... I don't think it is. I don't think it is. <laughs> Couple mismatched boots, a little bit more toys. The Tinkerbell's nice, that'll sell for sure. Right there, that was it. probably a very expensive toy. New, mm, I'm not gonna, it's too large to ship really. Uh, that's kind of nice, a little bit nice. Oh, this is, um, what's that brand, see that logo right there? Forget, Razor? Uh, yeah, it's Razor. That's a good brand right there, but it's a little thrashed. Kind of sticky, I'll just let it go. All right, there's a PlayStation controller. I'll put that aside. I've been putting all the... I've been finding quite a few controllers here and there. Oil filter. What is this? This is a Barbie. Missing her hands. What's with the outfit, though? Is that Captain Marvel? Hmm. I'm not sure. Royal Tenenbaums. Hello Kitty. Lights up. Not exactly sure what that is. Oh, that's cool. Forget the name of these dolls. Oh, well, look at this, guys. Prada. I don't think so, but I'm not positive. Does not feel like it. It's got really bad wear right here. I don't think it. It's not a Prada. I think that's a Nada, but I'm not exactly 100% sure on that. I'm put aside. It's not going to be worth anything in that condition, but on this guy's other locker. Ooh, there's a Casio vintage scientific calculator. On this guy's other locker, I did find, what was it? It was a Gucci bag. A Gucci bag. Oh, that's neat. Lucasfilm. That's some sort of Star Wars piece right here. Hmm, I'll sell it though. Oh, X-Wing. Hang on. Huh. That's a little bit better. Oh, maybe I should keep this up. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like it's from Halo right there. Oh, neat. Look at this. Cookie Monster puppet. Oh, I want a cookie. Uh -huh. I do want a cookie actually, but I'm going to put him aside. Harley Davidson poker chip. Look at this guys, pretty cool Disney sweatshirt, but unfortunately a big stain right here. I think I'm gonna put it aside anyways. See how that Disney, I mean the Mickey like goes from light and then he gets darker and darker as the pattern goes. I think that's cool. And then I just found this watch right here. It's kind of nice, I'll put it aside. Splash ring, I think it probably lights up. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Hot Wheel, and then look, got a bunch of more Harley Davidson poker chips at the bottom. So I'll gather those up. Those are kind of nice. They actually feel like they're good quality too. All right, over here. Okay, because we went through those bins that we've already been through. So we went through those bins. Now I gotta get start digging in here. And you see back here, guys, there's a bunch of broken glass right here because something fell. It fell from one of these shelves or something. It was dark. We couldn't see what we we're doing. That kind of stuff happens. There's a Funko Pop right there. I'm not sure who that figurine is, but. Careful, the glass, there's Wolvie. There's a brand new strawberry shortcake. Not an old one, but still kind of neat. And then it looks like a Dragon Ball guy back there. Another couple Funko Pops, I have to get those out. But let me sweep up this glass and clean the mess up a little bit. And then I'm gonna start digging in this clothes. I'm not do too much film in there, cause um, yeah, it's just clothes, right? If I find something interesting, I'll stop the camera. I mean, I'll start the camera and show you guys. All right, this is kind of good. Let's check this out, guys. Dun, dun, dun. True religion, very nice. Very, 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 very nice. You know, I haven't sold a pair of these in a long time, so I don't know if they still sell, but usually this is like, I don't know, 75 to 100 bucks used. 
And then these right here, man, there's a big old hole right there, but this is Rock Revival, made in Vietnam. Looks kind of nice, I don't know. It feels quality, it feels as good as the True Religions, quite frankly. That looks like True Religion, looks like it, and it is. Size 34, another nice pair. This is good stuff. There's another Rock Revival, oh, I thought it said Revival. Oh, it does say Revival, the words are just gone. Man, those are nice. All right, guys, started grabbing some off the top. Let's see what we got. Right. Not a great start. What is that? Universal Psychrometer. Huh, Psychrometer. It looks old. So are these. Hmm, I'm not sure what that is. It's different. We'll put it aside. Okay, sorry guys, we got some dirty hands here, but... I must get through the plush. All right, there's a little Joker plush. That's that's cute. This guy does something. You can tell it's got some batteries. Ooh, Wario. What the heck? Oh, Wario is worth a little bit of money, I think. I found one recently. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. We have to put that one aside. That's kind of cool. Ooh, Miss Pac-Man. With some fur in her mouth. Pokemon. Oh, what's this? This does something too. And battery operated. It's like every single one of these things was left on. Hmm. Very cool. Okay. Another Pokemon. This is a good little box right here. <laughs> Look at this. Huh. Pretty cool. Yeah, this is this is a good box right here. Like I said before, it seems like it's starting to get better the furthest back we go. And this is pretty good. These are some good plush. That's Pac-Man. It's a little ghost. <laughs> that is funny. Oh my goodness, this is some good stuff. Some shoes. What is that supposed to be? <laughs> that doesn't look right. Alright, I'll pass that on. Oh, there's a mushroom from Mario Brothers. There's Pokemon. And this is a good box. Elf on a shelf. Wow, it's good stuff here. Plastic Man, nice. This has got some really good toys in here. We'll definitely go through and pull all this kind of stuff out, guys. This is this is stuff that will be making it into our live auctions right here. This is this is some decent stuff. Stormtrooper, Batman. Nice. There's some more of that Friday Night at Freddy's or whatever it's called. Five Nights at Freddy's, I think it's called. Five Nights. Great box right here. I mean, I'm, I'm keeping most of this stuff. Not that one, but a lot of stuff we're keeping. All right, I'll go through the rest of it, guys, and then we'll grab another box. Uh-oh. Here comes trouble. <laughs> How's it going? Sandwich. Oh, wow. Thank you. Wow, it's pretty empty now. Yeah. Jana, this is so nice. Brought me a sandwich from one of our favorite delis. Oh, okay. So what do you think? I cannot believe it is from the last time I came here. It was packed. Yeah, it, it, me and Noah busted out a lot. This is day six, I think, of me being here. Six wow. days of going through this stuff. But I think I'm going to finish today. And if I don't finish today, I'm going to um, just put the stuff in the trailer and go through it later. I went through a couple bins from up there, and they're actually pretty good. good. Like, look at this. Uh, I just pulled out right here. We just wow. went through it. Look at this. Look at all these plush. Oh, wow. This is Five Nights at Freddy's. That's the movie that's just coming out. See? Cool. The movie's coming out. There's Super Mario Brothers. It's good, right? Great. Plush. They're pretty clean, too, these ones. Yeah. Surprisingly, and then tons of action figures. Hmm. Pretty much all this stuff down here is keep. Down there is keep. This is keep. This is all keep right here. Uh, all this is keep. This is all stocked in in here. Oh, okay. This doesn't look like a very fun box right here. Well, maybe it'll get better. Ooh, Starbucks. So weird. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Why would anyone keep that? I don't know. The games are kind of interesting though. Not really. This is a nice volleyball. Yeah, it's decent. I mean, it's not great. Beach it's Jam. Beach it's not great. What about that? A little teddy bear. It's Winnie the Pooh. Um, nope. Is the yeah. Oh. It's a little golf set. Little team. Look, these are interesting. Executive golf set. 1990. <laughs> we might be able to sell that. What do you think? In our live auction? Yeah. This is kind of cool. It's sealed. Yeah, we'll definitely put that aside. See, I just put the stuff aside like in here, and then we got to go through that a second time. This is all stuff. Well, I'll go through a little closer than that. I won't quite dismiss everything that easy. Right? 
Hot Wheels. It's a plastic one though. We want die cast. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Mm, you know McDonald's toys. Angry Birds. Oh, Not me. Yeah, what's that? I don't know. All right, maybe it is all stuff. That's cool. Dang it. I wanted to find one item so I could say it's not all Stockton, see? See? But it's okay, all Stockton. Right. Oh, this is a keeper stuff, I think. Yeah, records. That's cool, Captain. Now. Yeah, it, I don't know who this is from. It's like some kind of... I don't know. Do we keep this? Yeah, it's like somebody was a photographer. Well, maybe this go to Stockton then. Yeah. Uh, this is, I found at the very beginning. I didn't know. You know, if there, I was going to find some famous photographers stuff. But, Oh, this is that old comic right in there. That's cool. I told you I found one old comic very early on. Oh, man. Look at this. Well, it's in decent condition. Yeah. Dick Tracy is a 10 center. That's awesome. Yeah. All right. Well, th this is probably not worth anything, right? No. But these are cool, huh? Look, missing persons. Yeah. It's fine. Okay. Just got a couple more bins down in this one. Looks kind of interesting. It's very dirty, though. The ones up top are getting all that stuff that sweats through the concrete up there. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, yeah, it's gross. $4. This is interesting, Lego. Check it out. Yeah, that's what but it I, is. That's great. Might it's be a little bit older. Like yeah, just sell the whole thing. Yeah. But oh, there's the Ray Charles too. Cool. Spider growing on it. Look at that. <laughs> Drinking fountain for your dog. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, that'll go to the market. But this, oh, look yeah. at this. Yeah, that's kind of nice. Okay, Ray Charles is cool, but Yoda's way cooler. Oh, his, his mouth. His hands busted. Yeah, his mouth. Oh man, what does he do though? He looks cool though, huh? Oh, he moves around. He's got wheels. Looks like he's had a mouth injury. Oh man. Someone him in the face. Huh? It's too bad. It's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. What should I do with him? He probably his mouth moves. Probably talks. He's gonna have to go to Stockton. Oh, sorry, Yoda. Sorry, Yoda. Your fate has considered. <laughs> <laughs> Ray Charles is neat. Price things. Oh, this is neat. Look at this. Oh, Peppa. Peppa Pig. We got all the little books. Talk to <laughs> What's that burning thing on this? What is that? This. I don't know. That's like for a drum, like a bong? Don't know. That's bizarre. Yeah. I think it should go in the garbage. Yeah, we'll let them a figure it out. Camera. Yeah, that's cool. That'll sell, maybe. I was hoping to find something amazing. Oh, do you want to keep looking? <clears throat> Did you see anything amazing in there? I mean, there's more baby toys. So let's see. <clears throat> but I do see an X Men doll. What? You do? Yeah. Grab that. That's a Funko, but it's, it's gone. Empty. Let's see what's in here. It's Debunko. <clears throat> Doing a community service by <laughs> Seriously. Oh, look at this. Emergency use yeah. Huh. Intriguing. Well, uh, that is something I've never found before. Five year shelf life right there. Water with an, an expiration date. Turn it around. It's interesting. April 2020. Huh. All right, I have to do it. You don't. It's in my job description. You don't. Locker yeah. water challenge. This is the first time. Locker nuts first right here. Oh man, it expired three years ago, dude. Almost four. It doesn't taste like eight-year-old water. It tastes <laughs> now, good. Now, when you have diarrhea tonight, don't be crying to me. Well, hopefully it's tonight, not today, because there's not exactly an outhouse in here. <laughs> You're gonna be hitting a bend. <laughs> <sighs> that was actually refreshing. It that really, is not It really true. was. You are so full of it. No, I'm not. Really? Yeah, it was good. It tastes good. We'll miss the action. Uh, Deanna was just coming by for a few minutes. We did find some water. Expired water. Water. You know what? If, if uh, it's the end of the world and there's no fresh water anywhere, you wouldn't be complaining about an expiration date. Yeah, I might. Right. Oh, yeah. You, you might be complaining about it, actually. <laughs> All right. Why don't you show them your sandwich I brought you? I gotta go Ooh, through my hands. Show them those hands. Ay. Look, Ma, no, no, no gloves. <laughs> That's what you call stores walk our hands. It is. But you know what? He always says it builds immunity. That's right. That's right. 
Okay, it's our favorite. We're going to give a plug for our favorite sandwich place. Brass Bear. Brass Bear in Alamo, California. If you're in town, check it out. That's what it looks like. The best main sandwiches ever. Roast beef, lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise, mustard. No cheese. That's your order. I'm going to have to. I got to go wash my hands. Camille said, how do you know what dad wants? Because he's been getting the same thing for how many years? Uh, 17 years. 17 years. Same order. Gosh, we've been going there for 17 years. Yeah. All right. Let's take a look in this. I love this stuff. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But look, you paid $1.99 at Goodwill. Huh? It's weird. This kind of stuff. Okay. Loot Crate. Another Loot Crate. The Joker. Uh, probably picked it up at Goodwill. I don't see a sticker. Wait, did I see a sticker? No. No sticker. A lot of cheap little toys here, like McDonald's Happy Meal type quality. It's a little better, but it's really dirty. I'll let it go. Oh, that's neat. Chewbacca. Disney little vinyl figures. It's a little higher quality. Marvel. <laughs> nice fidget spinner. Mickey plush. Oh man, there's so much little stuff in here. I'm not sure what this guy is. Uh, this feels a little nicer quality too. Disney, Pixar, put that aside. That's kind of stuff I'm looking for. Oh, obviously I'm looking for that kind of stuff right there. Some vinyls, Spy Funko, Mickey and Minnie, that's a really good find. That's the stuff we look for. And that's kind of neat. Simpsons Pez, for sure. Wow. There's a heavy duty wrist rocket right here. I think that's how it goes. That's a nice piece right there. All right guys, I really will go through all of this. I don't know if it really makes sense to do it, but I'm going to. I'll pull out the better stuff. Let's send the rest of the market. Oh, that's neat, Super Mario Brothers. There's a, what's that? Funko and Kenobi probably. <laughs> Wonder Woman. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. Captain Kirk. This is Star Trek nesting dolls, it looks like. Oh, there's Spock. Yeah, this is a neat piece right here. That is very cool. Scooby-Doo. Oh, a little Venom right here. That's neat. Oh, this is neat. There's a Pokemon. Uh, like a gold card right there. That's actually... That could be worth a few bucks. It's at least ten bucks, but it could be much more. Jigglypuff. Let's look that up and see if we can find a value on that. That's neat. Nightmare Before Christmas. I don't know what these are. These, this is the Green Lantern right there, but it's like really soft silicone. And look at this one. Oh, this is a, this is a balloon, I think. Batman. All right, next box from up top. That first has seen better days. Uh, Batman's kind of cool though, and he's huge. He's huge. I think that's a Monster High doll, but it's missing her arms and her clothes. Still might be worth something. That's cool. Ah, they all Superman, too. Coach bag. Somewhere there was. A little die cast here. No red lines, though. All right, little purse. Bag here. Man, these, they're just getting destroyed though. I'm not sure what causes deterioration like that. That one's all right. These are okay, I guess. Not great, but they're okay. Idea bag's probably the best bag in here. All right, I took this off of here, and right below it, things got a lot more interesting. There's a comic book, sort of, you know, like a compilation. It says Batman in the 80s. It's kind of bent up, but still, it's a little bit neat. Look at this. 1967 Mustang. That's pretty neat. Owner's manual. Ooh, that's cool. Just cool. Okay. Cords. Tape. And look at that. Cowbell. <laughs> Who said they want some more cowbell? Very cool, very cool. Oh, look at this. Vinylmation mascot. This little Donald Duck, that's cool. Ah, these are some parts of that guy that we found in the other bin. I think I already loaded him. The dragon from Snow White or something right there. <laughs> One shoe in a plastic bag. All right guys, next bin from up top 
Yeah. Okay, first of all, we got a Micronauts comic here, number 33. I don't think that's anything special. And Micronauts, the new Voyages, number 6. I don't think that's anything at all, but I'll still put it aside. It's an old binocular case there. It's neat. Alright, well, it's look neat on the top with the comics, but what's this? Honda. Huh. Not sure what that is. It looks like maybe a speakerphone or something. Hands free, perhaps, perhaps. Take better care of your car and the people in it. What? By Verizon. I think it's a hands free device right there. I'll put it aside. Oh, oh, look at this, guys. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Dang, that was nice. Gucci was nice for half a second. It's Transformers right here. Another action figure guy here. Oh, there's a part to a Mustang right here. Yeah, okay, I don't know. Is that worth anything? If you're gonna find some car parts, I think Mustang would be a good one to find. Ah, a comic shop. Ooh, look at this guy. Turtles. NFL playing cards. Oh, that's nice. Nikon 35 millimeter camera. Yeah, there we go. Cable lock for a bike. Giant. Brand new. Mmm, this one's neater. Revere. That's an actual movie camera. History right there. Another bike lock. Brand new. Well, good thing I, I went through this a second pass. I was about to just chuck it to the market. Found some old uh, stamps right there, but then this was underneath it. Look at that. I thought it was baseball cards. It's uh, Garge Pail Kids. Number 138. Outer Space Chase. Nice. 